could both start well. They're that kind of pedigree. So you know, we expect it to be hotly contested. And, uh, you think Peter trying to win over the Irish. He's also trying to win over Chizzy's fans. <laughs> Well, I know, John, that you love the 32-57 route that Peter Wright just just tried because that was your forte, wasn't it? Well, it's the same level, the double 16 and the treble 19. So it's a nice little move over if you get the 32. Of course, you, you can't do a perfect uh, nine dark game starting on 32. You're more worried about winning. Indeed. Stephen Bunting earlier persevered with tops and maybe should have gone for 32 a bit more and who's to say maybe he was thinking of the nine data he eventually got beat by Mark Webster it was a great start 60 the crowd already making it known who they want to win Peter Wright, Peter, Peter Wright. 60. The trousers and hair have worked already, John. 60. Oh, great adjustment. 140. So hard sometimes to bring that car just down that little fraction. Yeah, you need that touch, that feel. Some can do it, some can't. Peter Wright, 149. Peter Wright fans. 60. Treble, 19. 70. Treble, 18 or treble, 10. 133. So a great setup shot from Wright. Leaves Chizzy. Reeling a bit here. 80 requires 16. For a brilliant first leg. Are you sure on the first leg? These are right. The last Can time these two met on the big stage, Dave Chisnell beat Peter Wright 7 1 in the Premier League. But that is not this format. Double start is it's brutal. It really can be a confidence basher. Well, not only that, but the sets. Sets are, are tricky as well at times. Yeah, it changes everything, doesn't it? 51. You can go missing for a set, and you've only lost a set rather than the, the first three legs. And every every second or third leg seems to have a pressure on it that you wouldn't have in a, in a, in a straight uh, match play format. 73. The feeling that Dave is not particularly comfortable as yet. Tugging at his shirt there, maybe a wardrobe malfunction. Well, if you ask me, it's a malfunction no matter what's right with it. Look at look at the colours out there, dear oh lord. 140. You know, uh, Dave, he can be a bit of a slow starter. I've seen we've seen this quite a bit in the Premier League, and maybe the first leg or two or three, and then he suddenly clicks in. But uh, you don't have that luxury in this format it's no real trouble to have to be perfect against a man like peter wright peter wright is 45 is a real late bloomer he's been around for for decades but it's only been the last five years that he's really found his his a game she's a runner up here in 2013 phil taylor Looking like he was never going to win a leg, but he did eventually. Gone are the days when players used to wear black or navy and have sensible haircuts. Huge pressure on him. Just was put on the Chisnell. It's a nice out shot. One treble, though. And that's the trouble with those two. 57. Yeah, needed the first dart to go above that 57 or in. Big visit already in this match. Oh, you're too good, man. You're too good. Double four now for a break of throw in the first set to move 2 0 up. 
Well, I'm not sure that the, the pause there and the reset was, was what he needed. It's hard to say with Peter. He's one way or the other. And it's more, if he does hit it, it's much more of a drain on the, the opponent. In this case, Dave. Double 10 missed. He's just not looking effective at the moment. And it's going to settle Peter right down for this double two. Nobody likes double one, though. For that reason. You either have half a mind to go a little high or to go right at it, and then you it's up a bit. Yeah, you off want to pull it, don't you? Aim on and pull it in. Well, this is a real messy leg. Can he hit double one? No school. The answer is no. Chizzy at the four. moment is feeling it because normally the shot there was after the single five was a one double two, but he's struggling to find any and kind of rhythm. And John, when you are struggling, the lower doubles can really, they're hard, aren't the they? Because you can't throw aggressive at them. It's easier to be aggressive on double one. A nice marker here for Peter to come alongside, but kicks it off a bit. Oh, good switch to 19, stays down below. Not the best of starts, but the way Chizzy's gone, he's not much threat. Although he has got 98, or 96, sorry. And, uh, you know, that was quite an easy break that Peter Wright just got in that last leg. He's, 57. Looks like he's kind of gone off a bit. He, he was, he started fairly well. Sometimes you follow the other player, and sometimes it's for the worse, sometimes it's for the better. And in this case, I think they've brought Pete down a bit. And now he's throwing good darts again. It's, it's a bit of rope a dope or something. Yeah, you can be dragged down. But you can also be dragged along. Well, they really were fine grouping. Now they're at it. 100. Has the throw to win the set. Chizzy will have a poke at the 170, but it's some ask. Yeah, a lot hinges on this dart, if it's treble or not. If he gets the treble, then Dave's in real trouble. Oh, yes. 140. Right knows 170. it. So does Chizzy. Got to go, Dave. Another one. Another one that I owes. Leave double 18. 134. Every match is a, some kind of turning point. Is this going to be it if you're Chizzy? Does Peter Wright miss and then Chizzy hits? Well, that leaves 42. Oh, he's staying there for treble 18 to leave double 10. Slightly 46. surprised. It must have been obscured 36. to a point. Yeah, well, that wasn't obscured at all. Bang, first start gets his first leg of the match. And he did some pretty decent scores in that leg. And wasn't a fantastic leg, but... You know, he's got to feel a lot better and like he's got a chance of coming back in the set all the way, especially getting in first dart. Exactly, and he's throwing now to make it two all, and we know what can happen in this format, John. It's not like just normal straight start 501. It can change around so quick, and maybe, just maybe, it has. <laughs> well... I don't think Wright's going to just uh, let him come back in, is he? Look at that throw. Fantastic in shot. It's the best he could do. 132. He's come alive. It was pitched as one of the best contests in on paper anyway of the first round. Along with Adrian Lewis versus Raymond Van Barneveld. He's taken a couple of legs, but now they're accurate. Uh, this is the highest caliber of, of darts you could hope for in the first round, really. They're both under stresses and strains, both under pressure. 
I haven't seen the totals averages to back it up, but there's a lot of tension in this because it's such a short format. It would be a horrible result for either player to lose in the first round. But that is a mistake. He'll be back, but he's going to have a lot of questions in his own head after that one. That's, you don't want to give your your opponent the chance to pressure you, even though he doesn't have a finish. He can still pressure. 94. They record 25. Nine for double eight. Double eight now. Yeah, a bit of quality there. Two legs all in this, the first set. Peter Wright was 2 0 up and looked to be coasting. Now, it's anyone's. Beautiful. Yeah, class. Replicates his effort from the last leg. This time he's first, though, and he has control. Chizzy. Right with him. Has to. Takes fantastic composure from both players to produce that. The final leg of the first set. And these are producing darts from the gods. Oh, my. 100. This is why Peter Wright is world ranked number four now. Chizzy, number ten. Well, that's five perfect darts. Oh. 123. Well, I, I think sometimes the rankings lie. Chizzy is better than tenth, I, in my opinion. Raymond Van Barnabo is number 16. Oh, my. Is that right? 55. You've got to perform, though, John. Got to perform in the biggies. Otherwise, you will slip. But what Chisnell is doing in this leg is performing in the biggest leg of the match so far. 140. And we've mentioned timing is so important. After nine darts, against throw, double in, and he's on 78. To break and take the set and have advantage in the second set. 140. All Peter can do is hope. Chizzy misses. 54 for 24. Yes. Yeah, that is disappointing after Maybe being so close 60. to coming back from 2-0. Taking the set. Surely you feel right will now take the gift. He does indeed take that gift. Wins the first set, the leading 2-0. Eventually wins it 3-2. Chizzy missed two darts to win that set. Can he turn it round? on Brendan Dolan. Well, Chizzy Second might look on because John, he was 2-0 down in that first set and scrapped his way back in and really should have taken full advantage and won that set, shouldn't he? And, you know, perhaps, as we were talking about before, like the slow start. He, he, first couple of legs, he just wasn't here in the match and he had to put himself in the worst position where he couldn't afford a miss and sure enough, it cost him. 89. Because he played brilliantly the last half of the set. We have to say he's really looking good the way he's playing now and certainly capable of coming back once more. But no room for error. Well, the quality of leg from from both in that last leg was superb. The, the composure they showed and the sheer belief and will to win. 20th. That wasn't his Sunday best. That is the stage for this week. The stage is set. 100. Yeah, it's uh, always a you know, good atmosphere here now. And, you know, 
back in our day, you would turn up for a first round, and maybe there wouldn't be that many people. It'd be quiet a little bit. The first round used to be a little different sometimes, and well, you sure don't get that now. Forty-four. Right. He's having a leg off. Fifty-one to leave thirty-two now. Sixty-seven. Yeah, it's odd because you know Peter just really was fortunate in the end to win that set. You'd think he'd be a little more fired up here starting this one. He appears to have relaxed though. Yeah, the urgency is definitely gone for this leg. It will return. Maybe, just maybe, he's not out of this leg as yet. Maybe he is. Made hard work of that, Chizzy. And we've, we've spoke, John, about the, the pressure you can put under yourself by... Pre pressure on yourself by missing. And Chizzy did that there. Third time he has done that. That is brilliant from Peter Wright. The 32, 57, 57. He loves that combination. Well, was, I think he said it three times now. In the course of, what, seven legs? One hundred. Cheesy's had five perfect darts. Already in this match, not this time. The leg is more important than a nine dart. Uh, he's masterful with the scoring now, Chizzy. Right under all kinds of pressure just to try and get opportunities for double. Even with the ins he's been getting. I mean, the last two times he had that in, he he was lucky to get a chance for double if he did. At this present moment, Dave Chisnell is playing better than Peter Wright. We know that can change so quick as it's the nature of the sport. 100. Looking more focused. Peter's action just doesn't seem as, as direct, John. It just seems a bit lethargic all of a sudden. Yeah, it isn't convincing. Whereas Chizzy has become convincing. Well, he might as well just go for ball the way he's throwing, but he won't. You would have, John. You would have. 87. Chance. For a hold of throw. Been totally outscored as Peter Wright in this leg. He needs 60 60. Not this time. Yeah, low again. As you noted, now he's overcompensated. 90. A required 20. Double 10. Double 5. This is undue stress. It really is. You don't need all this, Dave. It becomes more relief, doesn't it? It really does. And he's 2-0 up in and the second set. Well, he's putting right through the ringer in this capacity. I mean, each of these first two legs, he went to the board with double, and it hit the third dart, the double, and that, and that does damage to your opponent as well, psychologically. As Peter's thinking, oh, school. I might get a chance, and then it's gone. Yeah, Phil used to be the master at that, didn't he? Well, still is. You think you have an opportunity, and then it's taken from you. He's got that down pat, John, hasn't he? Yes. And he's good, he's right to stick with it. Forget about perfect games. Try and win a match, especially a match like this where your opponent is of a caliber equal to yours. Nine darts will not you win you a hundred thousand pound at the end of the week. The ebb and flows of this match. It's just you can't take anything for granted. One player going off the ball, the other coming on. We saw in the first set, it was right that was up two legs to nil, and 
Chizzy mounted the comeback. And it looks like Wright should get a break opportunity here. And the start of a comeback the other way. The only difference is if Wright comes back, he'll win the match. Indeed, yeah. Which heaps the pressure on the Chizzy all the more. It's funny, guys, up 2 0 in a set, and you're talking about pressure on him, but needs to win the set to stay alive. We can stay there. 57 will leave 170. No pressure. 14 for tops. That is the easy bit. That's the hard bit gone. Pressure now. On Chizzy, because if he loses his leg, it will be possibly 15 darts away from going out. And like you've already said, John, he's 2 0 down in the first set, pulled it back, should have won the set. But with Peter Wright hitting this 32 and 57 combination relentlessly, it's brilliant. It really is. Yeah, it's funny, he's getting only 108s lately, and he's disappointed, obviously. We've had so many 146s. Yeah, shoddy, isn't it? <laughs> Good game. Quality contest. It's what we expected from these two. He has marvellous belief in his ability and just the way he, he can play the game, does Peter Wright. And coming up, we have Michael Van Gerwen takes on Keegan Brown next. The reigning champ, Michael Van Gerwen. Adrian Lewis takes on RVB. Chizzy. It's a 180. Ella Klassen and Brendan Dolan take to the hockey last on this evening. What a cracking opening night so far, and he's still got all that to come. You lucky people! So many good matches. Chizzy pulling ahead, but doesn't leave an out shot. Still, right in a figure, needs to get this 2 4 8 done in six darts to hold his throw. Well, he's already at 10 one forties. Another one would certainly help. Yeah, and leave 108, which, gee whiz, <laughs> you think he can hit it? <laughs> <laughs> Just needs to be the other way round. But he didn't get it. He no, didn't leave it. We'll so. never know, John. We'll never know now. Unless he hits 40, of course. 66. Chizzy's protecting. You can definitely see that. The last six darts, the rhythm has been slower. He's trying to be more methodical and just plonk the darts in. Doesn't work that way, I'm afraid. Stay there. Another treble 20. Yeah, good job to leave a double. It's Chizzy. Oh, for ball. He's hit it the trebles really well, though. I wouldn't be surprised if he didn't. No. 18. Four ball. It's double seven. What a great job there. Sometimes a lot of guys play it safe on that second dart. Just go for the fat 18. And Peter Wright has nailed that 32 again, followed by 57. This is one of the best exhibitions of starting I've seen in a long time. I think with Chizzy, John, he, he likes that area of the 18s, doesn't he? The trebles and doubles, where he feels comfortable going for the 54. And it's certainly come into play there. Stood him in good stead, that. Yeah, I think Chizzy would be very pleased he didn't get forced into the deciding leg in the a second set. The level match, and pretty much it's hard to say who's throwing better at this particular time. Chizzy was ahead for a bit there, but... Uh, Peter's game is coming back up. Yeah, I completely agree. One person has seemed very likely, but it was only at the end of the first set they were both on. So what's what does this hold? What is this set? What's it going to throw at us? Ninety-seven. Which is he getting aggressive? It's treble 20 to leave a finish. No. 96. To leave the 170. It's 
Still right. Once again, under pressure on his throw. Perseverin with the 60. Fuzzy can hit it. Can he? 60. Oh, they were unlucky. Three well thrown darts, I'm afraid, but only 60 points scored. Chizzy's got to punish that. Second dart was miles too slow. It's in a perfect position, though. I think 92 will trouble him much. Do you think he goes 60, John? Because I do. 130. Yeah, he requires it's hard to say. He, he could do it when you're hitting the trebles well, but I think he's playing that percentage. So treble 17 for double eight. No, he has to go back for bull. This is a break chance, though. All the gain. 67. Yeah, I just felt that I know he missed and he sees it say after someone misses, but the way he's hitting the 60. Well, we know he loves the 32-57 combination, so 19-32, simple. Incredible. Double eight. He will be absolutely fuming. Yeah, that's sort of a gaff. As you say, on a combination, he should absolutely eat alive. And uh, giving Chizzy this break opportunity. He's taken this out before in this match. 17. Pressure telling on both. Yes. Both with double four left, but it's right first. One dart's all it takes. Got away with that. But you have to take your opportunities. 56. There's pressure on Chizzy there as well to get away second or third dart and did. Can Peter Wright hit the 32 and a 57 combination again? <laughs> it's just amazing. It really is. This is how good you got to be nowadays. Oh dear. Boy, I bet he wishes that every tournament was double in. <laughs> Does it boy? I don't, is it? 12 scores of 140 plus, Eight, and four or five of them have been a 146. Well, there we have it. It's been a quality contest, hasn't it? Enthralling! 96. Still chizzy. With a good score, can maintain his advantage in this leg he started. 100. No. The 140 or 180. So now, right, really in control of the match, you have to say. 19s to level it off. No. So no finish, so a bit of a let off there. Chizzy now 140, 124 out. Quite doable. He needs another treble. If you think I'll need another one. And he gets it. That's his second 180. And what a time to do it. Yeah, that's you know, class timing for the 180. Well, you see that. Lifted the arm up just to float one over the top. And achieved the objective. But will it mean nothing? For a level gain in the last set. That's even close. Hold it. Lady requires 76. He's on the ropes. All right. Posing himself. They have one dart for tops. After he gets 16. 56. Just hovering over it. Fraction too long. Yeah, deliberating. said John just a slight hesitation in the right throw on that last that was complete enough to snatch from Dave Chisnell I can only assume he brought his arm back so slow and he's trying to force it to reach the target it's never gonna work he showed more composure than that man who doesn't look exactly composed right now does he Peter Wright in total control now in this last set. A massive break of throw. Now throwing for the match. Throwing for a place in the second round.
Yellow Klassen or Brendan Dolan await. Yeah, Chizzy looks distraught. It's one thing when you're losing legs and you're throwing well, but he's just making error after error. That'll help settle him down, though. He's found the double in. He's followed it. Well, my hat's off to you, Dave Chisnell. That is a great turnaround. Considering how furious he looked after that last leg, which was just, what, 30, 40 seconds ago, to do that just shows complete quality. 100. Shows you have to be in complete control of your emotions, and I said Dave was lacking composure. He wasn't. Well, he was at the minutes you were referring to. I mean, yeah, he, he you gathered wrong himself. To, to call it that way. Oh, thanks but he's support. regrouped. He's... Thanks for sticking up for me, John. I mean, in still. fact, most, so most players at, at that particular point wouldn't, wouldn't, wouldn't have a comeback. They would be done. Be over. 3 0. Chizzy. Well, he's saying that he throws three really good darts and only gets 60. And right, only needs six darts from 215. In practice, this is kind of a gimme, but under this pressure, nothing is simple. 130. Well, the reaction says it all. He was pleased with that. Jizzy wants to leave double four. Well, I'd be pleased knowing I had 85 left to win a match. 140. Easy require 85. Treble 15 for tops. All the 57. He has options. Single 20 or a treble. Bullseye. He hits it. Last start, last visit. Can he do it again? No. 60. Pretty good effort. Chizzy, can he find a double? Double 16. To stay alive he needs to move over get by the dart might even use it he doesn't need to it goes in and he has throw down this match not over yet it's nowhere near it is it it's still so so tough to call in simple terms chizzy holds then we go last leg but it's not that easy this is brilliant under pressure it's magnificent under pressure <laughs> What a good game this is. First round. Well, I guess that by this point, we'd all like to see it go to the last leg. Chizzy's kind of not giving us any other option. And finally, Peter Wright misses in. Let's go. Law of averages, I suppose. Yeah. Probability. Chizzy. I was going to say in control of this leg and to take it all the way to a deciding leg. But with Peter Wright, you're just not sure at what point he's going to score one four sixes off. Not this time. But he's away. Well, the only consolation for Wright is he knows he has throw in a deciding leg. So, you know, sit back and watch this fantastic display from Chizzy and hope he's using it all up. And he's hoping Chizzy's using all his good darts up and he won't have any left for the next leg. He'll have run out of 60s. <laughs> 100. Maybe require 80. To take us to a decider. Single 20. Which is he doesn't want to do. Ideally, John, is leave 20 here. If you're going to miss, Dave, you want to go high. Yeah, that, that's a good thought. And he has. Sensible thought and it's the result. He has tops and a lot less likely to go wrong for him. 100. One set all. Two legs all. We are going to decide. We're not geniuses for saying that we thought it was going to go this way, but at the very start, you thought that this would go very, very close, and that is just the way it's panned out. Is the throw, is the bullseye about two hours ago going to decide this match of who goes first? 38. 
Well, that's the second time in the match he's, he's hit the 38 inch. And he hasn't come up very often that he's had to. But Chizzy, oh, well, I thought he was on, on road to another 160 and pulled the second dart. Right, probably breathing a bit of a sigh of relief there. They are both nervous, I guarantee you. I don't care what rank, what seed you are, what you've won. It's a last leg decider. And as I mentioned earlier, it's just too big a tournament, too important to these fellas to go out the first round. One of them will suffer, suffer that miserable fate. 97. They are both potential champions. Can he see the 60 from there? The answer is no. 59. An error. Will he be punished? Good last. <laughs> we, normally in this match, we'd say a ton is a bad score, but in that case, that's a great score. What a typical last leg. He's aiming more, taking more time, aiming. Ah, oh, that is magnificent. It really is. The, he pondered between each each shot, steadied the arm, but what he did do was release them perfectly. That has given him the potential to win this match. And Dave just barely gets to a finish. So Peter will go for this. In any case, if it has to be for a bull, 64 left, two double 16s, no. Okay, he's going for the bull, for the match. 99. These are the moments you practice hour after hour for. You're thinking, throw a good dart at the 60. Make sure it's high. Make sure it's high. Again. Oh. It was a good effort. It really was a good effort. The tension! Nine for double eight. Double four. Heart will be absolutely pounding. Seventeen. A reprieve for Chizzy! Anguish! Yeah, right. can't believe he's missed that opportunity. Chizzy. Capitalize. Two darts for tops. He's taking his time. Moving over. That is a steal. That really is. Chizzy gets away with it, but it's a massive...